Um, hi folks, it's day 43 today. Um, just wanted to do a quick follow-up on yesterday's video. So I was talking about kind of some of the options that I went through with my psychiatrist that we've been talking about for the last few months. Uh, one of them was the ketamine infusion, um, which I'm still kind of, you know, I don't know, it's quite expensive and I don't know, it's, I'm struggling with that at the moment. But um, the other one that I mentioned was Alpha Stim, which is like a little machine which you attach electrodes to your ears and it passes a current through your you know into your brain basically but it's really low kind of voltage it's very you know it's pain free and it's, it's not dangerous it's very safe and yeah these alpha stim machines can go for i was looking into them today they can go for up to 900 quid um but it's a one-off kind of payment and you have it then um and you know hopefully it's not something that you're going to need long term it's something that you can kind of use as and when you're going through kind of like a bad depression um so yeah i'm kind of toying with the idea of buying one of those um and this is my it was my psychiatrist's idea but he said why not check on ebay just to see if you know you can get one a bit cheaper than the 900 quid one the brand new one from alpha stim itself and part of me was thinking, well, I don't know if I want to risk buying something like that off eBay. You know, it just seems a bit, I don't know, it sounds dodgy, you know. Yes, I want to buy a brain fixing machine off eBay, please. Um, I don't know. But anyway, I looked out of curiosity today and there's two at the moment that are going on eBay. And yeah, I put a bid in, so... I think I'm on £210 at the moment, which would be like nearly £700 saving. So if I can get it for that, then I think, why why not? I'll give it a go. Um, and reading into, you know, how it works, the Alpha Stim machine, it's pretty straightforward. It is something that you can do from home. It is something that you can do unsupervised. Um, it, you know, there's not very many side effects. You might feel a bit nauseous um the effect should be quite immediate though in terms of improvement in terms of your mood and things like that so it sounds really interesting i'm really kind of up for trying it um i don't think i want to spend 900 pounds on it though so and as much as i was a bit wary about buying something like that off ebay yeah i put a bid in so i think it runs till sunday so i'll find out on sunday if i get it or not I'm not sure how high i'll go um again i keep thinking to myself well you know this is my this is my mental health we're talking about you know how much is that worth on ebay <laughs> um but yeah i'll probably go up a bit higher i think um and yeah i guess i just i'll keep you guys and i'll let you know how it's going and if i win it or not and then obviously once i get it i'll start using it and i'll be like you know i'll let you you guys know how it is you know i guess um but other than that you know i've had a day just thinking about yesterday so thinking about the alpha stem and thinking about the ketamine um we also talked about lithium um and lithium is something i've always thought was kind of like for like bipolar people so people with like really severe you know bipolar and really bad mental health conditions whereas mine it's kind of moderate to severe i suppose but i never thought that lithium was used just on depression i thought it was kind of like to to balance out bipolar people so um it was interesting to find out that they do use it for just you know people who are have persistent low mood depression um but yeah, it sounds like a really complicated process that you have to go through. You have to get the levels right. If it's too high, you'll poison yourself. If it's too low, it won't have any effect. So there's a lot of kind of, there's you know, there's a lot of questions there about, you know, lithium. Um, also, kind of long-term use isn't recommended on lithium because it is kind of like it's a, it's a toxic substance, so you shouldn't really use it long-term. Um, but yeah, it's something of i've got to start thinking about it now i guess um but yeah i just want to do a video to talk about the fact that i'm 
gambling my mental health away on something I might be buying off eBay. So, yeah, it's interesting. Um, but, yeah, I'll leave it there. I'll let you guys know how it goes, like I say. Um, yeah, so I'll catch you guys tomorrow.